The second tip is to start at the end. Practitioners of online learning realize the value of backward design, understanding how to successfully assess student learning and proficiency at the culmination of the course, and then working backwards to create the necessary activities and content that efficiently bring a student to that point. This is where course and modular learning objectives come in. The best way to move your course online is to think about your learning objectives, which may cause you to rethink activities that successfully lead to students demonstrating abilities, skills, and knowledge. In the College of Business, many courses end with assessments. For the College of Business, we recommend these four options. A take home, give a week for students to upload to the D2L submissions folder. A D2L quiz, you can have a timed exam, but you make that exam available for a week. Now, Respondus Monitor is an option for some to add an additional level of uh, security to your D2R quiz. Then there are presentations, which could be recorded by your students in Panopto or VoiceThread. But if students have an other option that works for them, let them use that. Or your final assessment could be a project in which your students upload to the D2L submissions folder. 